All right, SPAC Daddy Doug here. Uh, today's video, I'm gonna go through four very important SPAC stocks that you should be aware of and probably should be investing into. Um, each of these have an acquisition date in days, if not weeks, and they're actually four very good stocks that are probably gonna all go up pretty significantly. Um, but before I get into this information, please subscribe to this channel. We're brand new here, uh, and we wanna get monetized really to help you guys out to come out with good content to keep you aware of what stocks to be aware, uh, to know about and any type of good due diligence that we come across here. What I wanna talk about is actually my favorite SPAC stock out of the entire SPAC, macro SPAC universe that we have here. It's Collier Creek Holdings, and they're merging with Utz Foods, um, and their act, the merger vote date is August 27th, so we're talking days away. Um, you know, both teams have great management. The Utz food guys are great. Um, the CCH guys bring a lot of stuff on board. It's a uh, great management team. They have the CEO of Kraft Foods. Um, and I have a video out there. If you guys want more information, uh, I go really detailed into that company. Um, they're very well known in the Mid-Atlantic and Northeast just from their products. Um, and you know, right now they're currently the, the largest privately held snack food company. And once they go public, they're going to be the second largest right next to Frito-Lay. Um, Jim Cramer had them on a couple weeks ago and the stock price popped up after hours. Uh, you know, when these guys had a talk about how excited they were for their acquisition to go public. Um, right now the stock price is at $14 and the stock has actually stayed at around $14. It's been very steady since their announcement, which is very rare for a SPAC stock. Um, the warrants are right now are trading at $3.50. They're up about 30% this week. Um, and if you don't have access to get warrants, it's very easy. Send me an email. I'll give you guys a, uh, a link to TD Ameritrade. Uh, and you get, I think with this, you get a, up to $1,000 on referral, uh, depending how much you use it. But it's a free platform to use. You can trade warrants. They have margin. Um, so I highly recommend it. Um, CCH. So August 27th. Uh, there's some analysis out there. People are projecting it to go up to $18 on the 27th or about the 27th. Um, in addition, people are also projecting to go $22 to $28 right after that merger vote. Um, so there's definitely move, uh, room for movement up. I don't think this stock price is going to go down at all. Uh, personally, it's my biggest uh, holder in my portfolio and actually my 401k. I put a significant amount of this. This is how much faith I have into this specific stock. Um, so that's the one I would be into at all if, at all next week. Um, the next three I'm going to talk about have acquisitions that are going to be occurring in the next weeks. Um, and the next stock is called Shell. If you guys follow this back world, you guys know this one. It's a great company. I love the product. Uh, Hillion Trucks, they're been merging with. Um, and there's no doubt that this company's got a great future. Um, in my opinion, and I guess... On the analysis in their investor portfolios and out, that's out there, they have a better product than Nikola, Tesla semi trucks, and the current diesel trucks you can get out there. Um, you know the technology saves on fuel up to thirty percent, and there's no doubt that companies are going to moving be moving over to this platform uh, for growth. I think that most. Based on a diesel truck, you're th saving 30% on fuel, and over the lifetime, you're going to be saving ton of hundreds of thousands of dollars by moving to a Hillion truck. Um, right now, the stock price is at $27, and you know, just goes just goes to show how much people love this company. Um, the warrants are at $10.30, um, and they're going to have their target uh, merger vote date is at the end of September. So after you get into Collier Creek Holdings and you make some money, maybe it's a good move to go over there. Um, and then the next, number three I'm going to talk about is Graph. Uh, Velodyne, they're merging with Velodyne Lidar. And there's no doubt if you've been following the SPAC world, EVs, there's an EV new SPAC coming out every other day. <laughs> it's such a saturated market. I think some of them are going to be winners, some of them are going to be duds. Um, but there's no doubt, like if if you know the you're on the old saying, if you're going to be going out and buying, you know, gold mines, you probably make more money selling like picks and shovels. Well, that's what this is. Um, you know, their they their product is uh, for autonomous driving, which all these companies are going to be moving towards, um, and they're on. 
probably going to be using incorporating their technology and in, into uh, licensing it out for their uh, vehicles. Uh, so it's a great great company to get into. Um, and right now the stock is trading at eighteen dollars. The warrants are at three dollars. So I think there's some really good value right now with their warrants. Um, and their merger um, vote date is going to be anytime in the upcoming weeks. So this is one to be into after Collier Creek Holdings. Um, and the last one I'll talk about is going to happen at the last week of September, early October. So there isn't an official date yet, um, but it's LCA. And I have videos out on this one too. I have videos on all these, all these uh, companies I talked about, but um, I'm not, I, you know, I have been very negative on them uh, just more or less because I, I, I think it's a great product. I don't like Tillerman. I don't like what he did with this company. Um, he basically used this SPAC as a bailout for his other companies. He lost a ton of money in his hotel business. Um, and he said, okay, how do, how do I save money, bail myself out? And he basically piled all that debt onto LCA, which doesn't even relate to his hotel business. And then on top of it, he, he made himself $30 million by doing this. But, um, you know, there's no doubt that online gaming, uh, on online gambling is very popular as more states outside of New Jersey, now Michigan, are you know, legalizing it. Um, he's, they're the biggest one right now. Um, right now, the stock is trading at $14. SPAC stock is at $14.75. The warrants on their ticker symbol LCAH um, are $4.30. Um, they're going to make some money. I'm not a fan of Tillerman. There's other options out there, but you know they're gonna. They're probably the last one to have their specs um, information out. So I'm not investing into it. But I, you know, if you want to make some money, it's probably gonna make some money. Uh, so those are the four that I have for today. Um, please subscribe to this channel if you guys want to. If for inf for further information, really, into spec stocks. Until then, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.